Hi everybody, this is Dale. Welcome to Not Too Shabby Chic. This is another episode of Hashtag Dale's Dex Challenge. <clears throat> Welcome. If you are just now tuning in to this regularly scheduled program, that was hard to say. Um, welcome. This is actually, um, I've got 30 entries. So, I mean, 30 people, but more than that entries because some people sent me two of these. So what I'm asking for is you to decorate and send me a memory decks card in your style. Decorate it with your colors and how you like it. And then on the back, I want you to put your name, address, your birthday. Very, very important to put your birthday because I want to begin to recognize and send everybody a little something something on your birthday. Um, so please be sure to put that information there. Also, put things that you might like to receive for happy mail from me. I've got some of everything, so the world is your oyster and your favorite colors or genre anything like that that would help me pick out some nice things that you would like and you could use in your crafting so these are some examples of some of the gorgeous memory decks cards that i've received and here are others just so you can get an idea your style they are all different they're all beautiful aren't they so that's all you need to do and I will be um, doing a drawing and I've extended the time frame to August 9th so you have more time now and the prize is growing daily as I get more entries I add something every time I get an entry the the prize package is full of vintage treasures and a few new things so you will have so much stuff to create journals with and craft with that you won't need to go buy anything probably for a long time. So let's get started. Today I have two entries I got in the mail yesterday. The first entry is Elsa the Bargain Hunting Crafter. Hi Elsa and here's my address for those of you who would like to send in an entry. Elsa is a new crafty friend and I can't wait to see what she has created. So let's open up her entry. I don't want to cut it, so I'm doing it off camera so I can be super careful. Because I can mess up something real quick. <laughs> oh. What have we got here? She sent some extras. Guys, extras are not... Um, required at all if you want to send extras they are greatly appreciated but you don't have to these are so cute elsa thank you so much i think i cut the bag um these stickers i want to open it okay i'm just going to pour them out right here look how cute these aren't stickers these are little die cuts aren't those sweet hello friends just a little note to let you know I'm thinking of you. These are adorable. Thank you so much, Elsa. Thanks. The best is yet to come. That, ain't that the truth? Because I've got five working days till retirement. Yay! I'm so excited. You are amazing. Lama, lam, how do you say that? You are amazing I think that's how you say it and this cute little tag with ice cream thank you so much for the extras Elsa I appreciate it now let's look at her entry everything is better with a friend Elsa this is absolutely adorable look at the gold metallic gold um, hearts and flowers and look at this little girl she fussy cut is that not adorable and the pink roll uh, memory decks card i bet one of her favorite colors is pink what do you think that rhymed let's look at her information she says there's a there's a sticker on the back that says however time is given first and then taken away every day is a gift her birthday is coming up guys July 23rd hi Elsa happy early birthday 
it's going to take me a minute to get started on everybody's birthday, so I'm going to start fresh in January, <laughs> keeping up with everybody's birthdays and doing you a shout out on your birthday on my channel, as well as sending you a little something. Um, her favorite colors are black, red, and gold. Well, all right then, it's not pink. Her favorite flower is a red rose, but she likes butterflies. She likes hearts, rainbows, and clouds. Her style is vintage and botanical, fun, and family over everything. Amen, girl. Family over everything. Thank you so much, Elsa. This is absolutely adorable. I will link Elsa's channel below in the description box, so make sure you check Elsa out. This is so cute. She's got a great channel, and we want to check her out and give her some crafty love and support her. Next, we have an entry from a dear friend, Stephanie, with Coffee Paper Scissors. If you don't know Stephanie, you are missing out. She is an amazing journal maker. I buy quite a few of her journals. <laughs> I love them so much. And she is just so creative and makes the most gorgeous things. So, Stephanie, looks like you sent some extras. Let me look at the card. So, you guys will definitely want to check these ladies out. And I'm going to, oh, there, there's the, we're going to hide that. The blessing of the Lord on the good things in our lives brings our deepest satisfaction, our purest reward, our greatest joy. Amen. Isn't that beautiful? Thank you, Stephanie. I love this card. Ephesians 2.10, for we are his workmanship created in Christ Jesus for good works, which God prepared beforehand that we should walk in them. Amen. She says, happy birthday in retirement. I'll be looking forward to your crafty videos. Thank you so much, Stephanie. I love watching her create because she is just so creative. I mean, it's, it's hard to describe. She sent extras. Oh, I love these stickers. From Dollar Tree, these are some of my favorites with the, the um, antique telephone, the camera. This is a camera and a sewing machine. Thank you, Stephanie. These are so cute. Roses and flowers, beautiful. And some sweet stickers with, of leaves that have um, some sparkle on them. And they're 3D. Thank you, Stephanie. You didn't have to do that, but I appreciate it. It's super sweet. Now, she's wrapped it in this beautiful um, eyelash trim. Love it. So, I'll <clears throat> be putting that to good use. Love this paper she's wrapped it in. Super fun. Again, you know, us crafters, junk journalers, we can use everything. <gasps> Look at how pretty. Oh, my goodness, Steph. <laughs> it's absolutely adorable. Guys, look at this. Keep some room in your heart for the unimaginable. And she made the little, she used the Tim Holtz paper dolls and put him some butterfly wings so he's a little fairy standing on a mushroom. Then she made this little girl a little skirt and a butterfly wings for her hat. And we have this eyelash trim at the top and all the layering. This is adorable, Stephanie. I love it. And she did the tag to make it have some height. So you've got all kinds of layers going on. It is so cute. She looks like maybe embossed or did a napkin over the tag. Whatever you did this, it's gorgeous. And let's see her information. Her YouTube channel is Coffee Paper Scissors. And her Etsy shop is Coffee Paper Scissor Co. Her birthday is February 15th. She doesn't have a favorite color because she likes everything. She likes vintage, floral, shabby chic, industrial. Thank you so much, Stephanie. You are so creative, so amazing. I love everything you create. Isn't this awesome, guys? And she didn't have a, a memory dex card, so she just made one up, and I told her I can punch it. So it is not a problem. And I'm going to empty out my last video's remnants and let's punch it and not mess up her beautiful card <laughs> perfect stephanie make sure i've got it kind of centered that looks about right 
Voila! Isn't that adorable? Look! Elsa, you and Stephanie are awesome today. Y'all made my day. These are beautiful entries. Y'all please check out Elsa and Stephanie's channels. I will link them below. Go subscribe and um, help them grow their channels and show them some crafty love. And you guys are just blessed me to death. So now I have 32 entries. I hadn't been counting them, but I noticed other people doing channels say entry number one, entry number two, etc. And I, I haven't really done that. So this will be 31 and 32. Aren't they gorgeous? You guys are the best. So I will um, show you now what I've selected to add to the prize package. So let me put my beautiful things here like so, so I can show it to you. Today is going to be fabric day. So I'm adding some laces. This is off of a dress and I've used it many times, but I just think it's gorgeous. It reminds you of Christmas sort of, but the flowers, it could be boho, it could be anything. And it's a beautiful color of gray and it's got the sequins on it. So this will be fun for you to use. Then I have another piece of a dress because I use clothing a lot to get lace and stuff because I can't afford the kind that I like unless I buy it off of clothing. <laughs> this was a dress and I love this and it's black so people who like to do industrial or steampunk uh, or super vintage grunge, this is gorgeous. It would be pretty for a black and white journal, wouldn't it? I kept me a piece of it as well. Isn't that pretty? It's just got some gorgeous texture to it. So here is this for you guys. And this is gorgeous. This was, um, I don't remember. I think it was a skirt. And I cut it up. I am going to keep a piece of this for myself, but isn't that beautiful? So that's going in. You're going to get half of this. And we have this piece of lace. Isn't that beautiful? Scrumptious, huh? I'm giving you a good size piece of that. Sorry if I jiggled you. Some of and this, uh, some of this may be vintage. Some may not. Some is not. This is a Battenberg um, doily. Or it could have been a placemat, I guess. Isn't that gorgeous? So all of you Battenberg fans, here's a luscious whole piece that has no stains, I don't believe. So it's beautiful. We have this pretty mustard lace. This was a top or either a dress, I don't remember. And I have um, cut out of it because I love this color with all the grungy stuff I do, but this would be pretty in any type of journal. You could use it in Halloween. You could use it for grungy, for vintage. It's just a pretty mustard. Love it. Then we have bright orange. This was a top and I think it is beautiful. Isn't that pretty with the bright flowers? It could be retro. It could go either side. They're both beautiful. This is a pretty piece. I think this is my last piece of this. And I have this gorgeous piece of crushed velvet. And it's that bl pretty blush color. Isn't this gorgeous? And I'm giving you a big piece of this. I love this. I've used it quite a bit. Um, and I think this is maybe the last I have of this as well. But it's so pretty. So you're going to get a, a generous piece of this. Isn't that gorgeous? Then last but not least, this was a balance and I love this lace. Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? So I know you guys will love this. You can cut it in different rows or use the whole piece. Whatever suits your fancy. So that's what I'm adding to the pot today. Everybody know that you are loved.
God loves you and so do I. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.